Hello guys, welcome back. I'm Julianne. I'm here to do my reaction video for Season 3, Episode 7 of iCarly. This time the title of the episode is I Moved Out. And yes, I am excited. We're back uh, doing more reaction videos for iCarly. You guys know how much I love this show. Um, it has been a really difficult uh, past few weeks, but I'm back. I'm ready, and I'm 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 here to do my reaction videos for iCarly, and I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys continue supporting for more. I do want to ask you guys something because today I'm gonna watch episode seven and episode eight, which is I Quit iCarly. So I'm gonna watch this one and I Quit iCarly. Uh, but I want to ask you about episode nine, which is like I Saved Your Life, and there are two versions apparently of the episode. The original and the extended version. Someone has sent me the extended version, but I don't know if that is the correct version of the episode. So, I don't know. Let me know how what the deal with that is and where can I watch it, like, officially. So, let me know. Um, but right now, um, I'm going to watch I Moved Out, and after this, I'm going to watch I Quit I Carly, which I think is, like, a double episode, so... Technically, there are three episodes posted today. But anyways, I'm excited. I hope you guys are excited as well. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you love iCarly. Subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell, and you can go right now to Patreon and watch the full uncut extended version for this reaction and so much more. So in case you guys want to do that, link as always will be in the description down below. And for now, I think that's about it. Without further ado, let's just begin with Season 3, Episode 7 of iCarly. Here we go. Extreme oh, you get to do the poor dog. Now here's Grubbles before picture. Aw, adorable. That's a face only a Gibby could love. What? But take a look at Grubbles now. Oh yeah. Grubbles. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Gibby. Looking good, Grubbles. What's up, great. Hot stuff? It's only duck, huh? So make sure you look at them. Look at them. Oh! Freddy Benson. Mom! We're in the... <laughs> I'm glad Mrs. Benson is back. I missed her. Middle of the show. I don't care. You have some explaining to do. Mom, can we talk about this later? <laughs> Sam, don't talk. Come on. <laughs> Maybe you'd like to explain the contents of this baggie. What is that? Oh, what is oh that? you don't recognize this asparagus that I put on your dinner plate? Oh. <laughs> Mom. I thought it was weed for a minute. I was like, what the hell is happening? But no, of course it's asparagus. We... Don't shoot this. <laughs> Sorry, I can't hear you over this embarrassment. <laughs> Mom, please leave. When a big boy eats his vegetables. <laughs> he sings. He just sings five, a song. Four, three, <laughs> That's so two. cute. She's going to have to deal with the fact that I'm a man now. Yeah, man. You are. <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Look at Sammy's wad of cash. Admire the wad. <sighs> Whoa. How much money is that? Yes. Here's a hint. How is that a hint? 350? 360. <laughs> Wait a I do not like this aggressive thing. I do not like it. These are deposits. When you were ready to be born, did I keep you waiting? Yes. You were pregnant with me for 11 months. I wanted to make sure you were done. <laughs> Isn't she an elephant? <laughs> Mrs. Vincent, are you all Freddy's friends? No, 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 Mom, no. they're not all my friends. Who wants to see his baby pictures? Oh, <laughs> no. Mrs. Vincent. Mom, do not show them. <laughs> special diapers. Oh, God. <laughs> and here's baby Freddy in the bathtub. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> You know, he is, he is right. I mean, he's not yet a man, like he says he is, but he does need to, like, she needs to accept that he has grown up and that some of the things that she does is embarrassing for him, you know? Excuse us. Everyone who does not live or work here, please step into the hallway. Into the hallway, please. Let's go. Go on. Now, out the expedition. Thanks to you. Who are they? Go, 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 go. Um, you guys can't just cut in front of everybody. Hush, please. Hey, what kind of cat? Distance. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, you guys want us to take pics of your cat? We're going to have to go. You all decided to open up a little pet photography business. Oh. Yeah. 
Well, stop it right now. Okay. Why Who won't you do that? I'm Stuart Butler. I'm Oliver Paisley. We're the photographers. And we're not going to let some children ruin it. Do you mean ruin? That's what I said. No. No. Ruin has two souls. I say ruin. <laughs> I don't want to ruin your face. <laughs> hey, you don't want to mess with her. Margaret, instead of window, she used to say winder. <laughs> Spencer, open that winder. <laughs> She's dead now. Wonderful. Fell out of winder. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. She had a heart attack. Go on. Okay, that that's not that's so funny. Can't be two pet photographers. Three Ever weeks? since Freddy was born, I've de-waxed his ears on every third Friday, which was yesterday. But he refused to let me. Well, you know, teenagers and their ears. You have to respect her also. It's his body, you know. All right. I'll just go then. <laughs> Mrs. Benson. <laughs> oh my god. This is too much. <laughs> I know she's concerned for his health, but. This is getting invasive. <laughs> he smiles. <laughs> oh no, oh no, oh no! <laughs> Mom, you treat me like a child and I'm not gonna put up with it anymore. What does that mean? Not... I'm moving out! Freddy! Yeah, you can't move out. Freddy! <laughs> I like his hair. Don't do it. No. <laughs> You're disgusting. This is fantastic. <laughs> oh, Spencer. <sighs> I can make spaghetti tart. What are they doing here? <laughs> Spencer's gonna get his ass kicked. Oh! Oh no, the cat! What on earth? Oh! <laughs> Oh, yeah, I mean, his face is not our problem right now. <laughs> oh, they trashed... Can we charge them? This this should be illegal, you know. Harmu? He's just a pussycat. Yeah, no. No, he is not. Wait, just a... how do you know their cat's name? Well, are you friends with those guys? I know them. They took some very nice photos of my daughter's bunny. For free! Okay, this is corruption. Why did they charge you? Break into our apartment... Trash the place and you don't even care? Watch the attitude. I haven't forgotten about pee on Carl. <laughs> <laughs> You're giving me a ticket? Yes. That vehicle has no license plate. It's not a... It's a prop. So are you. <laughs> this is... Show this us is out, wrong. please. We could set up our pet photography studio in my new apartment. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you have a Welcome new apartment. To Casa del Fredo. <laughs> this is where you live. Yep, it's all mine. You like it? Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. <laughs> hey, there's no bathroom in here. There's a sink. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Yeah. So the petographers can come trash it again? Oh, but we trust their well, place. If we teach them a lesson. What do you mean? They hit us, we hit them back. Harder. That's the Seattle way. <laughs> you mean we were saying so there wasn't any kind of... Con oh. Oh. Wow, you can actually feel <laughs> the awkward. <laughs> Hello, Freddy. I didn't realize you'd have women here. <laughs> he hangs out with them all the time. About your prune pop? I blame you. What me? <laughs> You're the one who got pretty interested in girls, and ever since then, his boy chemistry's been all out of whack. <laughs> Mom, yeah. I'm perfectly in whack. I'm not coming home. I live here now. Oh. Eat this prune pop! 
I don't want that, Boompa. <laughs> He should have gone to this place if she respected him, you know? Hammer for Freddy and <laughs> a big old baseball bat for Mama. <laughs> Let's get wrecking. Can't believe that Carly's actually gonna do it. Wait! Okay, <laughs> I, I knew it. I'm nervous. Stuart and Ollie! What? Oh. They're here, they're, they're coming in! <laughs> <laughs> Don't surrender, hide! <laughs> oh no, Sam! <laughs> I needed to pick something up on my way home. What? You kidnapped the cat? You kidnapped Harmu? How great am I? <laughs> Let's call the police. No! It says if you call the cops, we shave the cat. <laughs> oh no, we can't do that. <laughs> That's where you get hot. <laughs> Weirdo. Is it okay if I sleep here? What's wrong with your new apartment? I'm scared to sleep there by myself. Oh. You're too old to be scared. All right. You can sleep on the chair. Thanks. What about your room? Wait. How come you're sleeping on the couch? I don't know. What's wrong with your room? Nothing. Well, then why are you- I saw a spider in there! <laughs> uh, he's about five foot and... Wait! The chip! I forgot I chipped him! I can't believe he's still chipped. <laughs> Mom? Move back. I need my little Fredward at home where he belongs. Promise not to embarrass me in public anymore. Cross my heart. Oh. Aww. She has to accept that he's growing up. Oh, you know? <laughs> that's so adorable. <laughs> there. Where is Harmu now? I don't know. He jumped out the window and ran across the ledge. On the ledge? What? Freddy can see Harmu at his window. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Poor Harmu. Is he out there? Is Harmu all right? Yeah, he's just chilling on the ledge. <laughs> there he is. Oh. Harmu. Harmu. Oh no, Harmu. Why are you acting out? He should... Every time he sees me, he sinks his claws into my face. True. <laughs> What's going on? No. No. Oh! <laughs> Be careful! Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh my god! That Don't got me dizzy! Hey, guess what? What? Shut up! <laughs> my face is all vulnerable! Oh my god, are you gonna You're fall? There. He's gonna fall kitty, down! Kitty, kitty. <laughs> Oh, 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 my God, oh, my, oh, my God! He's safe! Let's leave! <laughs> Great meeting, you guys! <laughs> oh, Spencer, you're a hero. Okay, guys, so that was the end of Season 3, Episode 7 of iCarly. Uh, this is a great episode, and hear me out. I, you know, I have missed Mrs. Benson. I think it was great to have her back and all her craziness. Um, but I do think that, you know, Freddy was right in everything that he was saying. He's no longer a little kid. He shouldn't be treated as a little kid. And he should have, you know, the space and respect that he deserves. Of course, you know. As a mom, sometimes we embarrass our kids even if we don't want it. Like, for instance, her showing, like, baby pictures of him. Like, I could understand that. But, like, in terms of being invasive towards him and what he wants to do, like the cleaning of the ears or, like, when he, she's, like, eat your asparagus in front of the camera, like, things like that. I understand that you, ha you want to keep him safe. 
but there's a limit because he is still, at the end of the day, a human being who deserves to be respected and who deserves to make decisions like whether he cleans his ears or not. You can give the recommendation and you can like kind of like be there to like, okay, you have to follow through, you know, you have to do it. And, you know, I can't, I understand that, but go to being invasive <laughs> on his privacy, I don't think is a good idea. They grow up, kids are kids. We all have been through the, those teenage years, which, you know, when in retrospective, they might not seem too bad for us now, but when we're going through them, they're very dramatic, you know, and it is the world against you. And you don't want your kid to be starting to act out because, you know, you're putting way too much pressure on them, you know. So I'm glad that Freddy kind of stood his ground this time. And he was like, no, I like, of course, moving out was a big thing. And I was scared that something was going to happen to him. But um, if that taught her a lesson, then yes, you know, because she needs to be more respectful of his wishes and because he's growing up. I mean, he says, like, I'm a man now. I mean, not yet. He's still a teenager. Um, but um, she needs to respect him. And at the end of the day, that is what is important, you know. Um, and I like how, you know, Spencer was like really like he didn't took any side. He didn't win like like uh, team Freddy and was like, just just leave him alone. And like, but like he was trying to like get Mrs. Benson to understand a bit. And then he was also trying to make uh, Freddy understand his mom's uh, point of view. And like, he was like, okay, just go home, you know? And like, he was trying to be like a good friend, you know, and kind of remain in neutral, you know, territory just to kind of like, uh, help them both. And that's something that not a lot of people do, you know, sometimes you take someone's side, you have to take someone else's side and things can go crazy, you know, but, I think that it was very important that he was there and kind of in a neutral zone, kind of not 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 trying to you know move. Like he was just trying to be a good friend for both of them, uh, which is good. And it was something that they definitely uh, needed. Um, but anyways, what else happened on this episode? Oh well, the the this uh, people, you know, I'm really tired that people underestimate them all the time, you know, especially grown-ups, you know, that believe that they know better, that they have, you know, and that they're not going to let these little kids ruin their careers or whatever, you know. We have seen that with, even with Neville, you know. We have seen that with, with that guy that they they did, the the chef, you know. He, could, he couldn't handle losing. And the other, now we have these two guys who cannot handle the fact that... Um, there was these kids who were doing this business and they had, like, I don't think they understand why they were being so po popular. You know, I think they were underestimating the power, the incredible, unique power that these kids have at this moment with their web show, you know. And yeah, they were kind of like, you know, taking over this, this business. Um, but they were in their right to do so, right? Because... It's a free country. It's a free world. And I mean, at least that's what I think. Um, but they don't understand the power that they have. You know, uh, not even I don't even think that the team like the Ike Harley team understands how much power they they have at the moment, you know. Um, but yeah, it was it was it was crazy to see. But I'm glad that at the end of the day, they rebuild their studio and there was no harm done. Um but yeah, it sucks that they had to go through that. Spencer, poor Spencer. He's a hero. Let's be real. He's a hero because, you know, he sacrificed his face in order to get the cat, you know, and and, <laughs> and keep the cat safe. I wouldn't have done it. I, myself, don't like cats. I am terrified of them. So if it was like, oh, you have to just do it just to save the cat, I will have fallen. Like, I saw that image of, of, you know, Spencer looking down and I got dizzy. And it's a television show. So just imagine me in that situation. I will be like, yeah, no, you better get a leash or something. I'm not risking my life. I'm sorry. 
Is it is that bad? It's a, it's just that I'm afraid of heights and I'm afraid of, of cats. Like it's like you're asking way too much of me, so I wouldn't do it. So that's why I think Spencer was a hero today, you know, because he put his face out, you know, he <laughs> led the cat. I don't know how he didn't fall, you know, but thankfully it wasn't like that. He f was inside of the house and we were able to save Spencer uh, and the cat with Harmu. It was good. It was good. Um, but yeah, it was it was really funny. It was really really fun fun episode. Uh, the next episode is going to be a longer um, episode, which is like like two episodes combined. Um, but that's the episode I have to watch, which is I Quit I Carly. That is the one that I'm gonna watch right after this one. So stay tuned for that. If you are a fan of I Carly on Patreon, you get to watch the two episodes together. I mean. Three episodes. This plus the two, the, the next two. Right. <laughs> but if you're on YouTube, you do have to wait because I have to edit, you know, because it takes a bit. Um, but anyways, hope you guys enjoy. Hope you guys continue supporting for more. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you love iCarly. Subscribe for more coming. Hit the notification bell and you can go right now to Patreon and watch the full uncut extended version for this reaction and so much more. So in case you guys want to do that, link on the description down below. And for now, if you're on Patreon, also give it a heart. Continue supporting for more. Let me know if you're excited for the next episode. And for now, that's about it. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. I'll see you guys next time for more reaction videos for iCarly. That's it. Mwah. Bye.